Hey, what's going on? It's Rogan Josh. I did a reaction video for Strawberry's Wake by Dance Gavin Dance yesterday morning. Uh, I loved the video. It's one of my favorite reactions I've done, and I've tried to upload it five different times with all different kinds of editing and pauses added and editing it down and all these different things. Nothing is working, so I cannot get this video up. I also notice that there is no reaction videos for this song available, so I'm guessing that for some reason this particular song has a much higher level of protection than any other song so far, I don't know if this has been something that happens sometimes because I'm very new to reaction videos, but what I've done is I've taken my original reaction video and I have edited out just my reaction parts so that there is little to no of the song involved, but the link to the original video is down below in the description of this video. Please go and watch it. Dance Gavin Dance are amazing and this song is amazing. So please enjoy the highlights of my reaction to Strawberries Wake by Dance Gavin Dance. Thanks guys. How you going? It's Rogan Josh. Uh, we're doing a reaction video today for Dance Gavin Dance and their new song Strawberry Wake uh, off the new album Afterburner coming out April 24th. I have already done a reaction video for their song Prisoner which you can go and find. I loved it and I'm super excited for this one. So let's go. Very cool Swan Air. That's a nice soft opening. Beautiful start of the song. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, John Mess! <laughs> oh my god, he's the best. <laughs> he's the best, he's the best. Alright, I was laughing and I missed a lot of that. Let's go back. That's a sweet bass line. Oh, what a group! <laughs> what a cool film clip. That's such a cool line, I want you to matter to you. I haven't really been listening to the lyrics, I've been getting into the music, but that line, I want you to matter to you, I'm gonna have to hear it in the context of the whole song, but I love that line, that's incredible, that's beautiful. Ah, oh, Will Swan with that bling, man. <laughs> that melodic scream is so nice that he's doing. All right, I'm gonna go back, I'm sorry that I'm pausing so much, we'll go back to it. That's so good. This reminds me of uh, That's How Mat Battle Mountain 2, the kind of groove they had on some of those songs. Oh, the bass player in this band, I love so much. That shot that they keep going to of Will with the sunlight behind him is such a well-framed shot and it is just so cool. God, he's, he is like, I love how much they are supporting him in the things that he is doing, Will Swan with like the Swan Fest and he's got these uh, custom guitars now. They had Swan Air. I really love that they're, um, they're kind of really behind him with all of that stuff and making him a character. It's very cool. Oh, that bass line! What a groove on this song. <laughs> Dude, he's such a good bad guy. Wow, that's so cool. That's so cool. All right, back to three minutes. That little bass bit blew me away. That, how amazing. All right, about here. Oh, the tone of it as well. Amazing. All right. That's amazing. That is such a good bass line. The tone is great, the line is cool. This band is just amazing, aren't they? Was that Nate GSF? There is a dude in here that looks so much like Nate that used to play in Capulet. Where is he? That guy. <laughs> that extra's acting is so funny. I think it's not supposed to be too serious. Wow, what a sweet film clip. This album's gonna be awesome. I, I am so excited for this album. They're just... They are so well entrenched in their style that they've got so much confidence behind how they do it and what they do. Like, it's not trying to be anything else. It's not even really that heavy anymore. They've gotten to a point that John's screams fit to their style consistently. So they can just... And maybe this is him from the years of, of developing his vocal style, but it now... It doesn't need a heavy part of the song for screams. It's not like a screaming verse and a singing chorus or whatever. And it's been like this for a while, but now they've, I feel like they've perfected it. 
where his screens are just as much of a part, just as much a part of any portion like any part of the song as Tillian's vocals could be they just interweave them fit them perfectly Tillian's still amazing you know yeah what a great song this album's gonna be sick so the album's Afterburner coming out on April 24th that was Strawberry's Wake so they're still doing their Strawberry stuff uh Strawberry Swisher Part 2 I think is one of my favorite songs of theirs the how does it start Please Girl, something, something, morning, whatever. Amazing song. I love it. <laughs> I groove to it a lot. Um, sick. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, thank you for all of the comments. I'm getting a lot of really good feedback um, that I'm really trying to take on board with how much I pause, uh, how much I talk over the song, uh, trying to let the song breathe a little bit. But I just get excited and I talk a lot. So I hope that you enjoy the way that I react to these. If you do, please uh, hit a like and subscribe. Subscriptions help me so much. You don't need to, need to put notifications on. Just uh, subscribe. And then if you ever go to your subscriptions tab and you see that I've done a song that you want to hear or want to see a reaction to, please come and have a watch. Drop a like. Thank you guys so much. Uh, and I'll see you guys next time. All right. See ya.